In a web application, user interactions often trigger events. In Svelte, we can use on colon then an event name to listen to events being fired on a component. We can then perform a reaction to that event by assigning an event handler function. Let's listen to the input event and create an event handler here in the script section in order to update the text state variable when an input event is fired. We can also define the handler as an error function in line. In Svelte, we can actually define a two-way data binding to perform simple state updates like this with bind colon. A property should be followed by the colon. So in this case, we'll write bind colon value, then directly link it up with the text state variable. This way, whenever we update the value of the input element, the text state variable will be updated. On the other hand, whenever the text variable is updated, maybe by other actions elsewhere, the value of the input element will also be updated, like clicking this reset button.